What are we doing today? First, I wanted to get your opinion on some comments we got. God. Sounds terrible. Just give it up and savor the beautiful natural sounds of the harp. Too many effects taking away from the naturalness. <laughs> Think it over a bit harder. Think so, it over a bit harder? Yeah, yeah. You know what? I got the perfect pedal for these people. I got it. Give me a second. Oh, we don't like your harp to effects pedals. Yeah, well, you're gonna love this one. Placebo pedal. What does it do? Nothing. So how far do you think we can get from the natural sound of the harp with effects? Like what's what would be really pushing it? We did those already. Yeah, but not like this. <laughs> I get a lot of requests to run the Miku pedal into the far pedal, but a lot of people don't realize that they cancel each other out. So today I have a device that will allow me to run both of these pedals in parallel. <laughs> You're gonna hate me for this. This duophony thing, you can use an expression pedal to change the mix back and forth yeah. between the two things. So we're gonna use the old blood noise expression ramper to go back and forth quickly between the two and see what it sounds like. Yeah, I do hate you. I do hate you. <laughs> what did you do? So how far away from like the natural harp can we get while still keeping it like musically enjoyable? I think we should use the duophony again. Okay. Because I want to try to like blend a couple things together and try my best to disguise the sound of the harp. So plug this in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. Thank you. I have my tea to drink. Okay, I'm busy. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I'll just go fuck myself. <laughs> So on one side, I got my ring mod, Randy's Revenge. And then after that, I got my crazy banana pedal. Here's what they sound like. On the other side, I got my Dark Star with the Copper Sound stutter pedal. Both of those sides blended together sound like this. You thought that was it? You were wrong. It's headphone time. Get them. Because I'm going to add this to give it some stereo width. Now the whole thing sounds like this. great thing about that is that I like don't have to learn a whole new instrument. It makes me sound crazy without me having to learn like 50 different things. I have a question. For that person who said I'm ruining the sound of the natural harp, if they listen to this next part with their eyes closed and a good pair of headphones, would they still tell me they don't like the sound of this? You know what I mean? Like You think it's a visual thing, like the fact that it's coming from a harp is upsetting people? Yeah, I think they're like confusing but but, it. Yeah. But they would actually like it if they didn't know it was a harp. Exactly. I'm going to be using the BL44 for some nice reverse. And then I'm also going to be using Red Panda Bitmap and the GFI Skylar. And I'm also going to be using the Artificial Blonde at the end to give it some stereo width.
things like this blender allow us to kind of take something like this and tie it back into the natural harp. For example, we can use an expression pedal to blend in some of the dry signal. This kind of thing lets you transform the harp into this kind of crazy synth thing as it goes. So it becomes like a metamorphosis into something completely different. And you can start to achieve that kind of stuff live. That is cool. That's very deep also. Metamorphosis. <laughs> I wasn't thinking about it like that. I was just thinking, oh, here's the dry and then here's the effect. <laughs> I like how you think. It's good. Okay, great, great. Metamorphosis. <laughs> oh. Don't make fun of me. Oh, metamorphosis. We're going on a journey. So what did we learn today? Um, well, we learned that harp with effects sounds great and harp without effects also sounds great. <laughs> and if you want to hear more harp without effects, there's plenty of amazing harpists out there who don't use pedals. Um, Samantha Ballard is the first one who comes to mind. She's amazing. If you're thinking about getting mad at me for not playing dry harp, just go to Samantha's channel instead because she, she rocks. We also learned that parallel blending is fun and good. You can use this for stupid things too if you want. <laughs> For evil, stupid things, yeah, yeah. yeah, that you shouldn't do. <laughs> Nobody stopped to ask if we should. 